welcome back to my channel so today is the day right now I'm at the Megan Avenue one uh, so it's 7 40 in the morning we arrived quite early around 7 I think because we drove from Nilai to KL at 6 in the morning so right now I'm with my friend hello <laughs> she's a driver shout out to her thank you so much so right now we are going upstairs Oh, it's kind of dark here because we want to find a place first, and after that, I think we're going to eat, have breakfast. I'm kind of nervous, but I have to get ready, and I hope that everything be fine today. And I will update you guys later on. Well, I'm gonna vlog my journey today. Uh, we'll see how, but not like fully because there's kind of hormones in you. So I'll try my best. Um, yeah, we'll see how. She's so busy, man. I think she's the one's gonna be interviewed, though. Not me. And all the documents there. The least name, actually. But maybe at around 9 or something, we're gonna go upstairs. We're gonna be in the office. So, yeah. Where are we right now? <laughs> at the... Molten chocolate cafe. So we're gonna see what we're gonna have. Okay, it's actually the same like I O I. Oh, what is apa tu? Ini lagi best. Sebab apa tu? Apa tu? Creep and deep. Okay, sorry, it's the same with the deep and deep. But this one might be less sweet, I think, because she said that way. I never tried this one. I'm gonna try here. So basically, we decided to choose this one, Molten Chocolate Crepe with ice cream, 24 ringgit. She's trying to choose this one, I think. No. This one? No. no. So basically, this one is really big, I think. To be compared to this one, we have like three waffles here. <laughs> mm, but this one is kind of small. I'm trying to record myself, but you want to see something? <laughs> She's recording me too. <laughs> She's here. My friend's here. So guys, I'm going to show you guys here. This is Molten Chocolate Cafe. This is my first time. So let's go into it. Okay, continue. So basically, I get myself prepared with this all notes and you know, like the, the, the question that they might ask. But actually, when I went inside the office and the boss actually um, interviewed me, it was so simple, I must say that. It was really nice and it's just like very open. Uh, you can be yourself, that's the thing. Because I was just like, oh, maybe they will be asking this, why you want to work me and everything. So it was very simple. It was just like, okay, what's your name? Uh, where do you study? Um, your family background, just simple. First, uh, he asked me a lot. If you get this opportunity, is that uh, easy for you to travel? Like if I ask you to go to Singapore or somewhere, just one day or something can you do that and I was just okay sure and he asked me about my transportation so basically the boss just um, explained me more about the environment he tried to make me understand how the PR company works actually you have to be more proactive you have to be you know be flexible you have to do this and that you should have the integrity in yourself you know what it's clearly you want or your objective so I must say if you want to apply in PR companies make sure you are very open you are very flexible, you can, you know, move here and there. So, you have to be more multitasking. You have to do editing as well. You have to know how to edit. You have to know how to do the press release. You have to know how to, I think, negotiate with people more like a professional way. And that, that's the part that you have to deal with. Okay, I just remember this part. Um, whenever you want to go for an interview, make sure a few copies of your resumes and also your transcripts, <coughs> anything. Or documents or basically um, your certificates you have to photocopy a lot or make it like two three copies anything so that you know you don't have to rush on that day and also don't forget to smile, smile. 
Because if you don't smile, you'll be so awkward. Like, hi, my name is. But if you smile, it's like this. Hi, my name is Nani, and I'm from blah blah blah. Just be yourself. Be confident. Talk in a respective manner. Um, be polite. Yeah.